Hello again everyone, my name is Motive, the Demon of Motivation VTuber, here to bring you some more VTubing tech tips. Of course, this isn't directly pertaining to VTubing in particular, but I'm sure you guys have noticed in the last uh, set of Windows 10 updates from Microsoft, it came bundled with that stupid Windows Copilot AI crap that nobody asked for. But here it is anyway. Now, I'm sure you guys are wondering, can you get rid of it and disable it just like uh, Cortana or what have you? And the answer is yes. Let's begin. All right, so of course, first things first, you're gonna wanna be on your desktop to start this off. Now, I will reiterate, this is only for Windows 10. It will not work for Windows 11. I will release a separate guide on how to disable it in the near future. On your desktop, you're going to want to, on your keyboard, hit the Windows key plus R you should get a window like this to pop up. It's called the run window, and this will allow us to run specific configuration open. So for this one, we're gonna want to do gpedit.msc. So once you type that in to the run box, hit okay. This will open the local group policy editor. This is uh, what admins like to use in companies to employ different methods and templates on how a computer is locked down. So like it, it it disables features in Windows that they don't want people to have, et cetera. But in this case, this is exactly how we disable AI Copilot. In your left window here, you will want to look for the user configuration tab. Underneath that, look for administrative templates and hit the little very small, albeit arrow key, drop that down, go down a little more, look at Windows components and hit the down key for that as well. Next, you're gonna to wanna to scroll down until you see Windows Copilot. Give that a single click, go to the right window, hit standard so it fits all on one screen, and here you go. This is the option to actually disable Copilot. We have to enable this option. So you'll want to double click the setting here. You'll get this dialog window. We have to enable the option because this enables the disable, if that makes any sense. Click the enabled radio button here, hit apply on the bottom right hand side, click OK, close out of GP edit, and that's basically it for that. Then the next thing you'll want to do is just simply go to your start menu, go to your apps list here, the all apps. It'll give you a nice list of everything. And then of course on this list, you will want to find the AI Copilot. For ex I already got rid of it, but for example, right click it and hit uninstall. Once it finishes uninstalling and you no longer see it on your apps list, give your computer a shutdown or a reboot. I prefer shutting down because it ensures everything is cleaned out. And that's it, Copilot's gone. Now, Microsoft is very infamous for pushing things through updates that re-enable options that you may have forcefully disabled. Uh, the solution is for now to just follow this guide again and then re-disable it slash uninstall it. But uh, yeah, that should basically solve that problem for you. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching. If you liked what you saw, be sure to hit the like and blah, 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 blah. Hey guys, if you liked what you saw, be sure to hit like and subscribe. Also throw a comment down below as it really helps with the algorithm and pushes my content into search results. Also, be sure to check out the description below for all of my socials, including my streaming medias like TikTok, Twitch, my Twitter account, as well as anything else that may be pertinent. Thank you guys so much. See you next time.